Now, perhaps more than ever, we rely on software to power almost every aspect of our lives. But that reliance comes at a cost. A decade ago, a bug on your desktop PC was a minor annoyance, but today, a bug in a banking app could result in millions of dollars in financial loss, or a bug in a medical device, in the worst case, could cause serious injuries to people. My name is Insa Kang, and my work is all about making sure that software systems that rely on every day are safe, secure, and dependable. The standard ways of ensuring software quality in practice tend to be reactionary, meaning that we deploy a system into the market as quickly as possible, and we improve the software over time by fixing bugs that are discovered by the users. The downside of this approach is that first, bugs become much more expensive to fix as the system grows more mature. And second, for critical systems like medical devices and self-driving cars, the cost of a failure is too great to allow it to ever occur in the first place. So the goal of my research group is to make this process more proactive, where we ensure that these systems are safe and secure by design. You can think of this like the construction of a large complex building. Before a single brick is laid, the architects draw the design of the building and apply different types of engineering techniques to ensure the structural integrity of the building. In a similar way, my research group is creating new techniques and tools that can be used by developers to specify the design of software before they start writing the code and automatically analyze the design to discover potential problems while they're still relatively easy to fix. By providing these types of tools to developers, our goal is to bring the state-of-the-art software development closer to other engineering disciplines. And in doing so, we hope to ensure that the software systems our society depends on are safer and more secure than ever before.